it will be his race. You, whoever wins the first race here, that person's name is going to go in the book. Well, I'm picturing, to, to be honest, I'm picturing winning the first race ever at a Century Mile. Well, it was a great lifestyle and, and, and still is. And um, yeah, I mean, I just grew up with animals and horses and got a real rapport with them. And uh, yeah, I, I just like, be, I like being around the animals. If a horse catches my eye, he's got to be a typey kind of horse, you know, thick through the girth, good hip. Uh, nice head. I like a really nice. If I get see a nice head on a horse, I guess that's your initial, you know, outlook of the horse. But um, yeah, I just like a real typey looking horse. That's, you know, athlete. Looks like an athlete. Northlands was a was a was a great old racetrack as far as I was concerned. And if uh, if they just spent a little money there and helped us out, we'd have, we might still be there. But you know, they didn't seem to want to do that. And century come along and and uh, hopefully that gives us a, a shot in the arm for racing and you know if it wasn't for wasn't for century we probably wouldn't be racing riders can be a little more technical they're not you know they're not clamoring to get into a, a spot they, they you know they can they can plan things out a little better as they as they're riding the race you know like where they where they want to be at a certain point in the race without the tight turns and the 5 eighths tracks it's exciting racing to watch but you can get in a lot of trouble whereas here you got obviously more room it's wider it's big swooping turns we brought some horses down here last fall and galloped and the track was just had been just laid down and uh, there it generated a lot of excitement then and it's it's continued to grow through the winter you know we've had a really tough winter and uh, but it's warming up and getting nice now and, and, and the excitement's building and April 28th will be um, kind of the proof, I think. It's, I think it's going to be, a, like I said, I think it's going to be a real shot in the arm to racing in Alberta. The main difference is going to be the, the track. The actual track is a whole mile and the track at Nolan Pass it was just five for long, which make a big difference, especially for the horses. Uh, before it used to be a tighter tons. I mean, I, I've been in the big tracks and a mile tracks, and it's comfortable for us as jockeys, comfortable for horses. Surface is beautiful, long stretch, and you know it's it's comfortable any single way to get out there and and uh, feel your horse, feel yourself. And I think lo horses likes that way. Like they get to stretch a little bit longer. As soon as that you get out the gate. You, you know, it's a big track, they, they just like that. Like, they just keep going and going and going and going and you feel that power. The main thing is win the race. Go out there and win the race, uh, make owners, trainers happy and happy with myself and focus on win races, that's all. My favorite moment is first in the gate and after pass the wire in front. It's the most successful and you know the nice feeling for yourself with pass the wire first